Are you ready for a rescue mission that makes stormy seas and remote mountains look like a walk in the park? Space, with its vast distances and cosmic challenges, is the ultimate frontier for rescuers where traditional methods just won't cut it. But fear not, because Elon Musk and a SpaceX crew are here to save the day. With a flair for the audacious and a touch of Hollywood magic, SpaceX is gearing up for a dangerous rescue mission that could rival any blockbuster movie. This real-life interstellar is soon to make your pupils dilate in anticipation. So buckle up and get ready for an adventure beyond Earth's atmosphere like never before. Introducing the SpaceX Dragon Elon Musk's SpaceX designed the Crew Dragon primarily for ferrying astronauts to the International Space Station or ISS, part of NASA's shift towards American companies for space station flights. On May 30, 2020, the Crew Dragon carried NASA astronauts Dunk Hurley and Bob Behnken into orbit, marking the first crewed U.S. launch since 2011. After the retirement of the shuttle program, NASA relied on Russian launches to reach the ISS until SpaceX and Boeing developed alternatives. In 2014, Musk unveiled the seven-seat Crew Dragon capsule resembling Apollo command modules. The Crew Dragon capsule is 8.1 meters tall and 4 meters in diameter with a trunk for cargo and stability features. It has 16 Draco thrusters for maneuvering in space and a launch escape system with 8 Super Draco engines for emergencies during liftoff. The International Space Station and Space Tourism The realm of space exploration is an exclusive domain with fewer than 700 individuals ever graced with the title of space traveler. However, the definition of space itself can be debatable, predominantly occupied by seasoned astronauts who have ventured beyond Earth's atmosphere. Despite the allure and charisma of space exploration, a sobering statistic reminds us of the inherent risks involved. To date, 21 individuals have tragically lost their lives during space missions, a reminder of the perilous nature of venturing beyond our home planet. Nigel Packham, NASA's Associate Director of Safety and Mission Assurance, has underscored the gravity of this reality. The exact count of astronauts may fluctuate depending on the criteria used to define space and who qualifies as a space traveler. Furthermore, numerous other astronauts and cosmonauts have faced critical safety challenges during their missions, highlighting the unpredictable nature of space travel. The Columbia Tragedy Again, 13 years ago this week, on February 1, 2003, the Columbia disaster unfolded on February 1, 2003, when NASA space shuttle Columbia disintegrated during re-entry, resulting in the tragic loss of seven astronauts. Following this catastrophe, NASA halted space shuttle flights for over two years to thoroughly investigate its cause. An investigative board found that a significant piece of foam detached from the shuttle's external tank, puncturing the spacecraft's wing. This foam issue had been a known concern for some time, leading to intense scrutiny of NASA's management both in Congress and the media. The Columbia tragedy marked the second space shuttle disaster after the Challenger incident in 1986, which experienced a catastrophic failure during launch. Ultimately, the Columbia disaster played a pivotal role in the retirement of the entire space shuttle fleet in 2011. Since then, American astronauts have relied on Russian Soyuz rockets or commercial spacecraft such as SpaceX's Crew Dragon capsules, which initiated a space taxi service to the International Space Station in 2020. NASA underwent a complete recertification of the shuttle system post-Challenger. The accident's immediate technical cause was attributed to a poorly designed field joint in the solid rocket booster exacerbated by complacency within the organization regarding technical challenges. In response, numerous safety improvements were made, including hundreds of technical modifications and procedural changes. However, the underlying management issues proved more intricate and less resolved, highlighting the complexities of human systems and organizational dynamics. Notably, the crew escape system at the time had limited effectiveness, relying on parachutes and pressure suits. This limitation spurred the development of structurally robust capsule designs for human spaceflight, ensuring safer and more reliable evacuation options for astronauts during emergencies. The International Space Station The International Space Station, or ISS, showcases a high level of preparedness with multiple backup plans in place to tackle potential issues. 
This preparedness is evident through the regular servicing of the station by Russia's Soyuz and SpaceX's Dragon spacecraft with Boeing Starliner set to join in soon. NASA has also implemented robust contingency measures, ensuring a resilient framework for mission success. The Soyuz MS-22 coolant leak and the need for a rescue mission. In December 2022, the Soyuz spacecraft MS-22 encountered a concerning coolant leak while docking at the International Space Station. This incident occurred just before a scheduled rocket spacewalk. Although the leak didn't immediately endanger the ISS or its crew, doubts arose regarding the Soyuz craft's reliability as an emergency lifeboat for the MS-22 crew. On December 14th, video footage revealed coolant leaking into space through a small hole in a pipe likely caused by a micrometer meteorite or space debris impact. This raised significant risks for the return journey. With the compromised cooling system, returning the MS-22 crew became a concern for the Russian space agency Roscosmos, fearing excessive heat and humidity in the crew compartment. In response, NASA explored a potential rescue mission and contacted its commercial partner SpaceX. The request aimed to use the Dragon spacecraft to transport three individuals safely back to Earth. Challenges of the SpaceX Dragon Rescue Plan, Suitability and Timing Elon Musk, SpaceX's CEO, expressed strong confidence in the safety of the Dragon spacecraft. He emphasized its ability to carry up to seven passengers and its crucial role in facilitating NASA's astronaut transportation to and from the ISS in 2020. Concurrently, Roscosmos expedited the launch of Suyos MS-23 to February 20th, intending to bring Russian cosmonauts Sergei Prokop and Dmitry Pini alongside U.S. astronaut Francisco Rubio back to Earth. Following the arrival of its replacement, the damaged MS-22 will return unmanned. Furthermore, NASA contemplated involving SpaceX in the crew rescue operation. Although SpaceX has the financial means to ensure astronauts a safe return with their spacecraft, a minor hurdle emerged due to the absence of tailored spacesuits for SpaceX's Dragon occupants. Tommaso SCBA, the executive director of the International Association for the Advancement of Space Safety, pointed out the difference between Russian and NASA suits, which are designed to fit various human sizes using strings, and SpaceX suits, which are custom-made for a precise fit. The Ever-Present Danger in Space The potential danger of a mishap during a crew rescue operation remains a looming concern for the International Space Station. Natural hazards like micrometeorites, tiny pieces of rock or metal moving at staggering speeds exceeding 177,000 miles per hour around Earth pose a significant threat to human spaceflight. Recent events underscore this risk, with a cancelled spacewalk due to debris from a Russian satellite and thruster rockets fired to avoid collision with more debris. The fear of being stranded in space without rescue options is a daunting reality as seen in the perilous Apollo 13 mission nearly 50 years ago. Despite the ingenuity of the crew and NASA's mission control, the mission narrowly avoided catastrophe. While the Soyuz and Dragon spacecraft have served as reliable lifeboats, the recent Soyuz MS-22 coolant leak incident highlighted gaps in timely crew rescue plans. Concerns about ISS safety persist, especially as NASA plans to decommission the station in 2031, transitioning to commercially operated space platforms. The ongoing risks faced by the ISS during crew rescues remain a critical concern in space exploration. Looking ahead, the space community eagerly awaits the debut of SpaceX's ambitious Starship Deep Space Transportation System. Elon Musk, SpaceX's visionary founder and CEO, envisions Starship revolutionizing space travel with multiple launch per week, possibly even daily, especially for low-Earth orbit missions. Meanwhile, venture companies like Virgin Galactic and Sierra Space are actively developing cutting-edge vehicles poised for frequent astronaut flights upon achieving operational readiness. Stay tuned for more updates on these exciting advancements in space technology by liking and subscribing to our channel.